Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. I'm going to do a review on this Proctor Silex grinder. It's got a really nice design. I've got some fresh coffee grounds here. Um, this thing's been out for a while. Uh, it's simply just lift the lid off. And then down in there, these don't have, uh, they're not razor sharp or anything. Um, but this is kind of like a stainless steel chamber. It looks like it's pretty easy to clean up. But it won't activate until this little um, until that little piece of plastic there is going to go in and press the switch to activate it so that way no one can get their little fingers chopped off so this thing's got a really nice design you can wrap the cord up by turning this and it wraps up inside of here so it's got a little longer cord than what's showing okay so I pulled the cord out and it's got it looks like a relatively short cord Okay, so we're going to put some coffee beans in. That might be overfilling it, but we're going to give that a try. We're going to put the lid on, and we're going to kind of hold the lid down. And look, that must be like a window we can watch what we're doing, and I'm going to press the button. Seems pretty quick. So I'm going to lift the lid off. So that was a pretty full batch and it looks like it did it. I'm going to show you how much that actually is. Okay. Okay, so first impression is it's really fine. Okay, so by filling this all the way up, that's about a half a cup of ground coffee. And we're just going to examine it a little closer. See if there's any big chunks or anything, but no, that that seems I that seems like normal coffee. Okay, so this was ground with the uh, coffee grinder, and this was what I got from Folgers in a can. So it looks like about the same texture, but one big thing I'm noticing is, is the Folgers in a can is really dry. Now this came in a sealed bag, and the coffee beans kind of have that oil to them, that, that moisture to them, and so that carried over to the actual coffee grounds. They actually look and kind of feel like they have just a little bit of moisture or oil to them. Okay, so that half a cup is just what I use for a 12 pot coffee maker. I'm gonna go ahead and brew a pot of coffee and see if it tastes any different. So cleanup looks like it would be simple. This looks, this is dishwasher safe. And you're probably just gonna to wanna to wipe this out. This doesn't come apart. This, this uh, tray doesn't come out or nothing, but you're not gonna to wanna to get water in that little hole there or anywhere around the cord. So you're just gonna to wanna to wipe this out once in a while. So again, by filling it to the top, that's about going to be about a half a cup of ground coffee. And this takes less than 30 seconds to grind it up. And you can pulse it or just keep it running. If it doesn't stay running, it only runs when you got it pressed in. I don't think letting it run any longer than this to get it any finer. I think that's pretty much as fine as it's going to get. So a handy little trick I think I might use is you could just turn the, the machine over and then you can go dump that into your coffee maker. That kind of be, could be like a little carrying thing for it. Okay, so I let it run really long this time about three times longer than what I normally do and the coffee grounds just aren't any finer. Um, so really less than 20, 30 seconds is going to get it ground up just as fine as it's going to get. So cleanup was really easy. I like that these aren't sharp. You can just get a rag in there and you don't have to worry about cutting yourself. It was really easy to take over to the sink and I just wet the rag and then wipe this out and it wipes out really, really nice. 
So I wish I, I could show you the cord uh, wrap up, but you you hold this part and you turn this part, and you're going to turn it this way to make the cord wind up inside there. So that's what it looks like. I couldn't get my cord to go all the way back in, but it does have this really small footprint, and it is relatively quiet. Okay, so I've brewed two different pots of coffee. The one with the freshly ground, it tastes just a little better. You got a little more aroma of coffee, but not drastically, but it does taste a little better. So again, this is Just a Dad. If you could please like and subscribe, and thank you for watching.